alternating series. An alternating series is a series whose terms are alternatively positive and negative. The formal definition of alternating series is a series of the form u1 minus u2 plus u3 minus u4 plus so on plus minus 1 to the power n minus 1 into u n plus so on where u n is greater than 0 for all n is called an alternating series. Look at the symbol here. First term having plus sign. Second term minus plus minus plus minus that is the the terms are positive and negative alternatively. And remember that each value of ui must be positive. That is u1 positive, u2 positive, u3 positive, u4 positive. That is an important condition. Though we have plus minus plus minus sign, that is to connect the terms. But here the each value of the sequence un is positive. Each value of the series, namely u1, u2, u3, u4, is positive. We have some examples. The first example, 1 minus 1 by 2 plus 1 by 3 minus 1 by 4 plus plus so on plus minus 1 to the power n minus 1 into 1 by n plus so on. Here the n to term is minus 1 to the power n minus 1 into 1 by n. The another example, minus 1 plus 1 by 2 squared minus 1 by 2 cubed plus so on. Here the well-known series 1 minus 1, 1 minus 1 plus 1 minus 1 plus 1 minus 1, so on minus 1 to the power n minus 1 into 1 plus so on. 1 minus 1 by root 2 plus 1 by root 3 minus 1 by root 4 plus so on plus minus 1 to the power n minus 1, 1 by root n plus so on. 1 by log 2 minus 1 by log 3 plus 1 by log 4 plus so on, whose n to term is minus 1 to the power n minus 1 into 1 by log n plus 1. All these are all examples of alternating series. Gottfried Wilhelm Leibniz was a prominent German polymath and one of the most important logicians, mathematicians and natural philosophers of the Enlightenment. English scientist Isaac Newton and German philosopher Leibniz independently invented calculus in the mid-17th century. Yes. Leibniz developed as his most prominent accomplishment the ideas of differential and integral calculus independently of Isaac Newton's contemporaneous developments. It was only in the 20th century that Leibniz's law of continuity and transcendental law of homogeneity found mathematical implementation by means of non-standard analysis. He became one of the most creative inventors in the field of mechanical calculators. While working on adding automatic multiplication and division to Pascal's calculator, he was the first to describe a pinwheel calculator in 1685 and invented the Leibniz wheel. He also refined the binary number system, which is the foundation of nearly all digital electronic solid state discrete logic computers 
including the von Neumann machine, which is the standard design paradigm of computer architecture, followed from the second half of the 20th century and into the 21st. Leibniz made major contributions to physics and technology and anticipated notions that surfaced much later in philosophy, probability theory, biology, medicine, geology, psychology, linguistics and computer science. His father died when he was six years old and from that point on he was raised by his mother. Leibniz never married. According to Leibniz's notebook, a critical breakthrough occurred on 11th November 1675 when he employed integral calculus for the first time to find the area under the graph of the function y is equal to f of x. He introduced several notations used to this day. For instance, the integral sign representing an enlarged S from the Latin word summa and the D used for differentials from the Latin word differentia. In mathematical analysis, the alternating series test is the method used to prove that an alternating series is a convergent series. This test was used by Leibniz and is sometimes known as Leibniz test or Leibniz rule or the Leibniz criterion. We shall now state and prove Leibniz test.